NCS 100 NVD. Uh, we're going to be running a 550 volt motor with it. To start, there's multiple taps to choose from. Uh, we'll be starting on a lower voltage tap to break the motor over and then working our way up to the run tap. So to start, we'll just hit the AC on. The motor will begin spinning. Once it begins to spin, you can then change the tap up. Turn the back on. The motor will then continue to run. You can then change it to the to a, a tap closest to the voltage of the motor, which then will run for the duration of the test. Here you have your metering. The line to line voltage for the three phase motor. Also select your current. Your line of neutral voltage as well. Next with the MTS 100, we'll be running a DC motor. It's a 280 volt shock field motor and 280 volt armature motor. Uh, to begin, we'll switch it to from AC to DC. Start by running up the shock field. Fields ran up, begin by applying armature voltage to break the motor over at a lower voltage. We'll then work our way up. You can see the armature voltage and current here, the field voltage and current here. You can then begin your duration test. Every time you want your meters to read, you would just click read meters again. Once you're finished with taking your readings, you would click done. You can then generate a report. After you're done with your report, you then always make sure you turn your armature voltage off first. And then you can ramp your field voltage down to turn it off as well.